here with head coach Dan Evans following Ohio Dominicans win over Northern Michigan on Sunday afternoon. Coach, uh, a game uh, that featured over 30 ties and lead changes. Uh, really competitive uh, from, from the onset. Neither side able to, to really race out to a big lead, no big runs or anything. So what was the key for you to come out on top? I think the big thing is we stuck with it. You know, we had a couple stretches in the second half where we made some mistakes and gave them opportunities. And even when they capitalized and got out to, to a couple points or four point lead, our kids stuck with it, made good plays offensively. And we really buckled down defensively uh, down the stretch, even if it didn't always show it uh, throughout the 40 minutes. I thought we really guarded well. Uh, at the moments that we absolutely needed to. Mm -hmm. And talk about that defensive effort. You, know, you held them below 70 points, um, but really, again, the, the effort on that side, the competitiveness on that side, I think was uh, definitely a turning point for you, as you mentioned, especially down the stretch. Yeah, without question. I mean, the numbers aren't great. I just peaked at them. You know, field goal percentage D wasn't great, but it was a, a slower pace game for most of it. And I thought we really just hung around. You know, they had. Uh, a couple of guys step up on their end, hit a couple of shots, particularly number 12, Sorens, and hitting those threes. And I think for us to just hang in there and keep battling and keep trying to execute the right way was a, was a big, big step for us. Offensively, uh, you had a couple guys scoring in double figures, but really it was a, a pretty balanced effort overall. Uh, how were you able to execute so well on the offensive end? I think we shared the ball really well. I think we had 17 assists, which is good for us. We penetrated and created for each other, and we, and we passed it out of that. And I, and I really believe that there were some shots that most nights we probably make, truthfully, and we didn't quite finish them. Uh, but we got aggressive. Our tempo was good. We were, we were fast-paced in terms of off misses. Uh, and even on makes, I thought we got off the floor quickly and gave ourselves better and more opportunities. And, and when you do that, and we have a variety of guys that can create for each other. And when we do that, it creates really good things for each other. What was your message to the team after the game, and how do you look to build on this with a couple of road games coming up next week? I mean, I was just really proud of them, obviously. There's a lot of excitement in our locker room, and we've, we've played, as you know, several of games similar to this, um, and, and we had a rough patch there just before Christmas, but we played several games just like this one, uh, and this was the first time I really felt like we hung in long enough that, that we were able to make the plays we needed to, and, and that's a good step, but I think what you said is exactly right. It means a lot to us to get, get the win, but now we have to, to kind of regroup and build on it as we go back up to the UP uh, and, and continue to improve in the areas we need to improve because there are certainly some. All right, Coach Evans, congratulations on the win. Good luck next week. Thanks, Scott.